In today's video, I want to talk about several reasons why I believe that Gala will potentially at least do a 50x during the next bull run. And even though this isn't financial advice, let's jump straight into it. And the first reason why I believe Gala will at least do a 50x during the next bull run is because I believe that the Gala ecosystem is absolutely fantastic. You know, when it comes to Gala, there's Gala film, there's Gala games, and there's Gala music as well. And when it comes to film, music, and gaming, I do believe that these three industries have such incredible potential. And I first want to talk about the music industry. You know, for example, if we take a look at this, according to Goldman Sachs, they predict that the revenue for the music industry by 2030 is expected to be about $131 billion. You know, that's insane, right? The music industry has such amazing potential. You know, clearly, in my opinion, I think Gala being focused on music is such a smart move. And now, with that being said, I now want to talk about movies. You know, if we take a look at this report by Zion Market Research, you know, they expect that the global movies and entertainment market size to be worth around $169.62 billion dollars in the next seven years. I mean, that right there is very mind-blowing in my opinion. I think that the potential of the film industry can't be underestimated. I think it has so much room to grow. And last but not least, when it comes to gaming, if we take a look at this, when it comes to blockchain gaming, you know, the blockchain gaming market size is expected to reach $117.5 billion by 2028. You know, so overall, when I consider the potential of blockchain gaming, when I consider the potential of music and film, you know, when I consider all of that, I really do believe that the Gala ecosystem is truly focused on all the right industries. And I think that moving forward, as the film, gaming, and music industry continue to grow, so will Gala. I believe that I can't go wrong by choosing Gala. I think the ecosystem is top-notch. And reason number two is because of Jiri. And Jiri, by the way, is Gala's very own blockchain. And on Jiri, the Gala token is actually used for gas fees. And I think that right there is very amazing for Gala moving forward. Because as there is more transactions on Jiri, you know, as there is more traffic, there's going to be more and more Gala being used for gas fees. And I think as a result of that, it's going to do absolute wonders for Gala moving forward. As Jiri continues to prosper, I think so will Gala. And also, let's not forget, you know, just around a week ago, Gala launched Gala V2, which, by the way, is the new Gala token, so to speak. And Gala V2 replaced the old version of Gala that existed before May 15th. And the reason why I think Gala V2 is so special is because with Gala V2, there is an enhanced burn mechanism. And I think the enhanced burn mechanism is going to be so fantastic for Gala moving forward. Because with the enhanced burn mechanism, as more and more Gala gets burnt, you know, Gala is going to become, relatively speaking, more rare. And as we all know, right, as demand increases yet supply is low, the price is naturally going to go up. And I think that could very well be the case for Gala moving forward. You know, this enhanced burn mechanism, in my opinion, is just going to create more scarcity for Gala. And I think that during the next bull run, especially, you know, once that FOMO hits, you know, once people are trying to hype in Gala, you know, once all that starts happening, yet Gala is relatively scarce. I mean, Gala at that point is just going to go through the roof, in my opinion. I think Gala V2 is amazing, and I think Jiri is amazing as well. And this right here is what I really love about Gala. They're always constantly looking for new ways to improve. And that right there can't be said about most crypto projects out there. You know, a lot of crypto projects out there, they're not really looking to stay around for the long term. I mean, let's face it, right? Most of them, they're just focused on short-term gains. They're focused on gaining hype, focused on gaining fans. They're not really looking to, you know, develop any of their fundamentals in any significant way. But that is not the case when it comes to Gala. You know, their team, they're always constantly looking for new ways to improve, and they're always trying to become fundamentally better. I think Gala is being run by the right people. And reason number three, it is because I believe that the Gala Games platform is astonishing. You know, for example, if you take a look at Gala Games, they have around 17 games on their platform currently. And I think that right there is something to behold because when you think about it, right, most crypto gaming projects out there, they lack diversity and they lack options. But that is not the case when it comes to Gala games. You know, they have FPS shooters, they have third person shooters, they have roguelite shooters, simulation games, and much more. You know, Gala games, they are not short of options. And Gala games, they have very amazing quality games as well. For example, you take a look at Mirandas, you take a look at Spider Tanks, you take a look at Grit, you take a look at Superior. You know, all of these games, in my opinion, have A plus graphics. I mean, they look so amazing. You know, I think the games look very enticing and they look very fun as well. And reason number four is because Gala Games is focused on NFTs and DeFi. And I think this right here is a very genius move because I do believe that both DeFi and NFTs have a lot of potential and the data shows it. For example, if we take a look at this, we will see that by 2030, the NFT market is expected to reach up to $3.5 trillion. 
I mean, that's absolutely ridiculous right there. You know, the NFT market, in my opinion, has unbelievable potential. And now when it comes to DeFi, you know, as we all know, Gala is planning to enter DeFi. The Vox team is planning to build a decentralized exchange on Jiri, aka Gala's very own blockchain. With its very own decentralized exchange, Gala is planning to expand its reach in terms of DeFi. And I think this right here is actually very amazing because when you think about the DeFi market, it's actually expected to be worth over $398 billion by 2031. So clearly, right, DeFi, much like NFTs, have such amazing potential. I think that crypto projects that are focused on DeFi and NFTs will prosper in such an amazing way in the future. So in conclusion, when I consider the fundamentals of Gala, when I consider its ecosystem, when I consider its use case, and when I consider what industries it is focused on, and just how much potential those industries have, you know, when I take off that into consideration, I truly do believe that Gala will have no issues doing a 50x during the next bull run. I am extremely bullish on Gala, and I think that Gala during the next bull run is really going to surprise a lot of people. Make sure to subscribe. I'd greatly appreciate it. It's been Lee the Captain, and I'll catch y'all on the next one. I'm out. Peace. Bye.